I am excited, but this is my first blind date in a really long time, and I mean, Becca said he's my type, but the last guy she tried to hook me up with spoke Klingon and wore chainmail as undershirts. I really don't think she understands what I mean by a nerdy guy. Oh, shut up and go. It's a New Year's Eve party, so at least if you try to squirt on your jiggly pops, there'll be witnesses. Plus, I'll be there anyway. <laughs> just relax. Yeah, but won't I be expected to kiss him at midnight? It's just a kiss. That's what my dad told my mom 24 New Year's ago. And he disappeared into the New Year without a trace. Along with my mom's virginity. I wish I knew who my dad was. Just kiss him. It's hard to be so fertile about it when his balls drop at midnight. I hope not. I'm gonna butter that toast tonight. Mm -mm, I hope he brought a bathing suit because I just became a splash though. Oh! I hope he brought a flashlight because he's gonna be deep in this cave tonight. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Did you bring my slippery one wet sign? Because I'm about to set that shit over and out. I just want to sniff those balls. Okay, how do I look? You know what? Kind of like if Gary Busey and Megan Fox had a love child. Like, you look like a mess, but you owned in it. Kind of like Lindsay Lohan, post Freaky Friday. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. Just remember, never be yourself. All right, got it. Oh my gosh, Eve, I'm so glad you came. <laughs> this is Franklin, the one I was telling you about. What's up? It's nice to finally meet you. Becca thinks <laughs> that we simplex, I mean, simply be great friends. Or even more, huh, Eva? Why don't you guys get a drink and talk? <laughs> yeah, come on. So, you like Lord of the Rings? Uh, yeah, you know, battle for middle, herp. I mean, earth. Return of the Kings wasn't my thing. I've always pointed out all the stuff that was wrong. Yeah, I bet you don't like the return of anything. Uh, well that sucks. So you want something to drink? I'm a bit of a mixologist myself. Oh, uh, <laughs> no, I don't, I don't drink. Really? Because Becca showed me this video on the ride here. 2014, I love liquor. Liquor's my middle name, bitch. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, well, I decided that life is short, and, uh, you know, one, one thing you do could lead to a life of consequences in turn. Cankerous, or, I mean, cancerous, you know, like, like alcoholism. Um, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Can you excuse me? Allie, that guy has the eye of Sauron on his lip, and he won't stop looking at me. Maybe it's a zip. No, that perp is a herp. Okay, I can sense it. God damn it, Eva. Why do you think Becca would set you up with someone who has herpes? Because she hates me and wants me to suffer for the rest of my life. Do you not remember when I took her last tampon at prom and she bled out everywhere? Yeah. That was a pretty shitty situation. It was like hairy all up in there. But you know what's funny? Like, she dyed her hair red. Like, when she have like PTSD or something? <sighs> Alright, well, what do I do? Go talk to the guy. What's, what's the worst that could happen? Do you want a shot? Oh, me? Uh, no thanks. I'm telling you, the priest just lost it. And that Jehovah's Witness, he must shit his pants. <clears throat> wow, what a riveting story. So wait, the herpy was a herpy, and he lost a herpy, and then that other herpy shit his pants. Are you feeling okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Are you okay? You look like you might be sick, you know, like you might have a virus or something. You want me to, you want me to take a look at that? The word herpy is like on your mind all night. Are you trying to tell me that you got diagnosed lately? Did you just diagnose me with herpes? You just give me herpes over here across the table with your little herpy mind powers? You spitting your herpes on my face? Jesus, Eva. Do you mean this burn on the side of my mouth? What? I know it looks gross, but no, it's not herpes. I burned it with a hot spoon last week. Uh, I'm so sorry. I feel like such an asshole. Uh, I, I was just so nervous to come here, and then, you know, I come here and you're so good looking, and... Uh, sorry, I, I just can't win. The ball's gonna go in 30 seconds! Why don't you come watch this ball drop with me? Never watched with anybody so beautiful. Okay.
I'd rather share a lifetime with you than spend all the ages of this world alone. You just gave me herpes, didn't you? Yep. Like mother, like daughter, lifelong consequences ring in the new year.